Welcome to Ronin, a drawing software at the intersection of a terminal and Photoshop. Upon launching Ronin, you are presented with the current version splash, and at the bottom of the screen, a terminal. Frame, type, path, and brush are all Ronin tools, and each have their own cursor. Inputting frame and dragging the cursor across the screen will feed mouse positions to the frame module. Let's try it with the type tool. Inputting type and touching the canvas will put a blinking placeholder text at the mouse location and await confirmation. At this stage, the text can be moved around the canvas, updating the terminal. Each module has settings which are passive values that affect the subsequent actions. For instance, the type tool has a color setting, which sets the text color. Pressing Enter confirms the input and rasterizes the blinking placeholder. The mouse can also be used to draw and erase. Holding Shift will erase, while holding Alt will drag the content of the layer. Similarly to the type color setting, the brush also has a color setting. The square brackets increase and decrease the brush size. Typing source.help will display all available modules, methods, settings, and mouse modes. Typing source.save will flat the canvas and create a file that can be copied and saved. A lot of our works are grid based, and so we use the magnet tool to move the cursor onto a grid. The magnet tool's grid method expects a rectangle, which is the grid size. Once the grid has been confirmed, we can use the path tool to draw lines and curves onto that grid. As displayed in the bottom right corner, we are currently working on the logo layer. We can select a new layer with frame.select. Working on this layer will not affect what's underneath and can be operated on separately. Using the up and down arrows allows us to move between layers. The red layers are guide layers used by modules to draw overlays. They can be removed by pressing Escape. Ronin uses .rin files. You can load presets with terminal.load, followed by a preset file name. We can load the blank preset, which includes its own brushes and background color. Creating bookmarks with your browser of a preset allows to quickly switch between one file and another. For instance, each picture that we share on Twitter is created using the rabbits.rin preset, which creates a canvas of a specific size, loads our latest photo, puts our watermark on it, and creates a compressed file that we can then share. Anyone can create presets by adding new files into the preset folder, and load them directly through Ronin by adding a hash into the URL. For instance, following the Ronin URL of localhost and the port number, add hashtag blank to load the blank preset, or hashtag default to load the default preset, which is the application's splash screen. We created this software for simple repetitive tasks that we previously used Photoshop for. Ronin allows us to do these tasks faster, more precisely, and with less battery power consumption. Using a software that uses no libraries, no frameworks, and that works on all of our devices makes us more self-sufficient. We hope that this video inspires you to create your own tools. And as always, thank you for keeping us afloat. Literally.